G'day! Welcome back to Minecraft Down Under. This is episode 28. So guys, I've been doing... I did about six hours of AFKing last night in the new XP Gold Farm of Craziness. And managed to get a... And I did about four hours during the day, so... Um, yeah, got grand total of 460 levels so far. Our quest to 1,000 levels is coming along nicely. Now, um, you're probably asking, why am I naked? Well, I'm naked because every time I do a nice AFK, well, I'm not really naked, but every time I do an AFK run, I stick myself, stick all my stuff in here just in case, because, you know, I don't have all that many diamonds left right now, and, you know, my netherite tool, it's my very first one, I don't want to lose it, so I tend to make sure that I stick myself, stick all my stuff somewhere that I can get it back if, you know, if I die, yeah, I lose a bunch of levels, but I don't lose all my armor and stuff like that. Okay, so we're going to be working on the main base today, second floor, can't wait. I got some stuff to show you before that. Now, I did some changes to the XP gold farm. Uh, come down, come on down. So, what I ended up doing is adding uh, three more slices of sorter. To be honest, I was meant to add two, but I added a third just in case, you know, these combat updates come up in the future. I just thought, I thought of the future. You know why I've thought of the future? Because the... Um, uh, the combat updates that they're working on, potions now stack. And if that's the case, obviously I want them in my sorting sorter. So I added the extra slice for future. future. But uh, so these three now are all brand new. And the reason why I added three, so one is blank, ready for whatever I want later on, maybe potions. Second one is for blackstone, because if you didn't know, they swapped out glowstone trading. Uh, well, glowstone dust for blackstone in 1.16.2. So, Fan pointed that out. I added that filter in. And they have adjusted the drop rate of the spectral arrows to way more. So, I've got, gone ahead and obviously added uh, the spectral arrows now to the list of uh, things to sort. But have a look at the rest of the stuff. So that's gold, that's rotten flesh, that's how much crying obsidian we've got so far. Obsidian, ender pearls, and soul sand, nether brick, string, uh, uh, nether quartz, uh, iron, which I'll turn into to bars. Ooh, well that shouldn't be in there. That must have fallen in somehow uh gravel and leather and the fire charges which i don't even know what i'll do with the fire charges but they're there they're there this eventually is going to fill up we're going to have so much obsidian so much everything we've i think the gold and rotten flesh is probably already overflowing into the into the disintegrator but um i definitely i fixed up the placeholders for those people that were worried about the overflow system if you we have to come over here i have to break a couple of things just to see it hang on just for those people that uh were really concerned but if we open this as you see i've got uh, just some cobblestone randomly named um on there because they were like oh data don't they don't don't do that but that was just placeholder um but yeah so it is all coming along nicely Nicely indeed. I'll probably do a bit more AFK tonight and a little bit over the weekend. We'll see how much we come back to. But um, everything is coming along very nicely. Okay, we've had a super chat from David. Thank you very much, David, for sponsoring and supporting uh, uh, this episode of Minecraft Down Under. He says in his custom super chat message, Been watching your videos for a couple of years. Wow, you're uh, definitely a veteran and have uh finally been able to catch a live stream uh don't fall <laughs> that's not very nice i'm trying not to with this amount of levels i'm really hoping my feather falling is gonna catch me okay so yeah i just thought i'd bring everybody up to speed on oh i better leave the eggs here let me do that um i just thought i'd bring up everybody up to speed on how the modifications on the gold farm xp farm yes Probably over the weekend, I will do a bit more work on, uh, you know, making it look pretty, ready for showcase. Next week, I want to release the showcase to all you guys. It'll be our second one of the season, done and dusted. Um, still don't really have a name for it. <laughs> but, um, yeah, we'll figure something out. We'll figure something out. But, yeah, we'll get that showcase probably mid, mid to end next week, done and dusted. So, uh, yeah. 
but I'm really happy with the that machine is just crazy awesome. It was worth the build, if you know what I mean. Okay, home sweet home. Got to be careful because um, it's not my time. Sun's coming up. Yes. The reason why I say that because um, since I've been AFKing so much, I've missed a lot of sleeping in the bed, which means a lot of nasty flying mobs try to kill us. Now, last episode, we got the roof and the outline ring installed on the main base, as you can see. So that is going to make way so we can finally start working on the second floor, or at least getting it all marked out on this day. It's Friday. Make sure everybody has a fantastic weekend, all right? Well, as we go into Friday, have a fantastic we weekend. But yeah, I'll see if I can't get odds and ends done in the world over the weekend but let's let's quickly run back grab some items here and we're going to start marking out what the second floor is going to look like i want a definitely want a uh, the, like a veranda so i've got to be careful on how much space not really a veranda i was going to make a lava pool I'll, I'll explain it all soon i'll explain it all soon hey chibi okay so let's go back over here We've finally unloaded, so we'll grab some polished, because we're going to need it. To be honest, I'll probably mark with the polished. It's mainly what we build out of. All right, polished, polished. All right, so we've got a bunch of polished. And um, we need... Uh, this is just plain black stone. Let's turn some of those polished into bricks. There we go. So we got some bricks as well. There we go. To be honest, the textures, are, for my eyes, I don't know about anyone else's here, I, my eyes, they're, they're really hard to tell the difference. Like, really hard. Like, just a quick glance, it is extremely hard to tell uh, difference. Chiseled, definitely chiseled, um, between some of the, the darker blocks here. And that's just me. That's that's really just a me. But we'll grab some warped as well. Trust me, probably going to need it. There we go. We need probably some more torches if we can. We'll head on over to the this, grab a stack of coal. And just so we can put some more torches on the roof while we're up there. Done. Okay, let's go mark. Let's be a roofer. Yep. We're gonna be a roofer. I don't have a catchphrase because I guarantee there's like a roofing catchphrase. <laughs> oh strip, there's black stone there. All right, up we go. But at least the, the uh, bartering system is literally giving us blackstone because I've been trying to mine big patches of this. Now I could just AFK for the blackstone. That's kind of a little bit cheating, but <laughs> it worked. It worked. Oh, I had a question about data. Where did you get all the mending from? Well, um, uh, obviously you missed the... Uh, you missed the part where we were doing the trading. There is actually villages down in Nasty Nigel's Tower down there. And um, there's a few villages and we managed to get mending on one of them. So it's it's cheap. It's like nine emeralds and a book or something. Yeah, something like that. So it's actually quite cheap. So I get paper, trade, get some emeralds, <coughs> buy a couple of, uh, couple of uh, mending books. But all my gear has mending. I did it on purpose. Because, you know, you got some, I got some decent gear here. It's not the best, but got some decent gear here. Not the best pickaxe, but I made sure it had mending on it. So I could go up to that farm at any time and repair the flame, you know, repair it. That's, that's exactly right. Um, okay. All right. So now I've got plenty of torches up here. We're not going to get jumped to buy those flaming mobs there. Just making sure. All right. So these little... This is, the bottom level is shaped like a sunflower. That's the best way I could describe it. It's, it's roughly like a sh sunflower. Now, these end bits here, my grand plan was to probably have two of them, two end bits, as like lava, like a pool of lava. So it looks awesome, like pure evil. And then two end bits as like a, 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 a veranda, you know, veranda out the back sort of thing, like so you can look out at our future builds and, and the landscape that hopefully we will corrupt and turn pure evil when we're doing that part of the build. But we've also got, you know, we're going to have like a guardian farm, a, a, sorry, a Watsi farm down there um, and other farms built around us. So, you know, we sort of want uh, that little bit of a, a look out there. Okay, so, hmm, all right, um, where to start? 
Well, first things first, Daddy, you should really, really mark out where the tower is going to be. So let's do that first, shall we? So black, so we got some uh, polished black stone here. And the tower itself is like a 5-er, a 2-er, so let's do that. So 5-er, uh, that's about that, yep, a 2. So, yeah, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, wait, what? That was 6. That was 6, Venom said, whoopsie. All right, that's fixed it. Look, easy fixed, easy fixed. All right, so that tower there is now continuation, see? See the continuation tower? That's awesome. And we'll quickly do it over here as well. We'll just do two points for now, so I know what I'm doing. So again, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, oh, one, two. I really need to learn to count. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, one, two. One, two, three, four, five, one, two. Okay, so that's where the towers are going to continue upwards in our base, our build. You know, they will continue going up. Now, to get the rough shape we're going to need, I'm just think, trying to think in my head how this rough shape is actually going to work. So obviously, uh, it's not going to be quite a sunflower shape in the middle here, but... It has to take up the middle. Hmm. Just let me think. Let me think. This is the problem about winging things and these crazy builds. You've you've got to use a bit of imagination. So maybe two, like bring it out a little bit, but not much. Give it a bit of curve. Everybody loves a bit of curve. Don't go straight because that's just silly. Hmm. That's that's definitely definitely silly if I because because it's front end's curved. So got to get a little bit of curve. Okay, that, that's always good. All right, so I'd come to the corner here and I'd probably go one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Okay, yep, getting a bit of curve there, that's good. All right, come over here and one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Okay, let me look. Look while you're going along. Yep, I like that curve. Yep. Ah, I love it. 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 All right. So go ahead and finish this off. Just finish off this with a, a full line of blocks like that. So that there should be our... See, I got a bit of a curve, but I don't didn't, didn't take it to extreme. I still got my veranda out the back. That's right. And uh, well, this is pull the lava or whatever we're going to use it for in the future if you know what I mean. <laughs> but I would love it to be like, one, as I said, two to be verandas or even one, and then the rest pools of lava and the pools of lava like dripping off down into like running off into the sea or something. Oh, ho, ho, that would be absolutely pure evil, which I like. Okay, so what we need to do next is do some marking of windows because that's obviously that's what comes next. Um, so the bottom bit here is, I've got to remember, so if we're going to try to replicate what we did down the bottom, uh, quick fresher, okay, so the first block here was a stair block, so now we need to sort of build this up a little bit, just by one for now, alright, we're using a bl base block of a smooth uh, black at the moment, we will change stuff out as we go along, there we go, okay, all right, so I did that because technically this bottom run here is for, you know, stairs. Like, I always put stairs. Set, leave the middle out because that will have patterns and doors and etc. built onto it. It depends exactly what we do with it in the future, I suppose. Okay, all right. Um, all right. Now, what we need to do is windows. I don't want too many. I want about two. So... I would just build up this in the corner. That will be wall. This would be definitely window. So that would be definitely window. I'd probably block that up and do window and then back to the wall. Hmm, I could do a double gap actually. It's maybe a bit better. Hang on. So now that's already a double, but the triple uh, close to that. No, because there's going to be slits in that already. Okay. So go ahead and just fix that back up. And change that out to that. 
Okay, all right, all right. So that's roughly, that's two windows. Yeah, that's exactly right. I don't want too many up here because the center is probably gonna have all these big slices in it as it is. All right, so that will be no window. Window. There we go. To the windows, to the walls. <laughs> sorry, sorry, my bad. Um, all right, now grab some chiseled. And uh, let's just build up here. All right, um, now come in here. We'll put chiseled, 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 chiseled. This is our center block, like we did downstairs, just like we did downstairs. Holy smokes, that means this is gonna be really tall. I just thought about it, guys. This thing's gonna be extremely tall. Okay, okay, well that's that's not a bad thing, I suppose. Well, no, smooth stone data. Not a bad thing, because this is just window one. Ha <laughs> ha, it's gonna be monstrosity. It's gonna be huge. Uh, um, let's go ahead and put that, 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 that. And then cover. I've got to go sleep. Actually, we shouldn't be. We no. Got to sleep. I forgot that we have been doing a lot of AFKing. Hello. Ah! All right. All right. All right. I get it. I get it. I'm going. I'm going. I'm. I'm going to sleep. All right. Calm it down, you two. Flame and galah. Where is it? There it is. We're at a way down. Yeah. I, I thought. I thought to myself. Yep. So we definitely can't just sit there overnight now because all the AFKing. Close the front door. Shut the front door. All right, jump into bed. <laughs> Let's get some Z's going. Nom, 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 nom. Here we go. All right, done and dusted. All right, let's go back. Oh, ha ha, you on fire? You have a bad day? <laughs> Did you die? <laughs> All right, let's go back up. Let's go back up. I don't think the phantoms even took a bar of health off me, AJ. Oh, oh it's coming along. You know, I can definitely see the potential. Got the curves and everything. Um, let's go back up. All right. Um, and, whoop, oh, there we go. There we go. Fill that in. Fill that in. This is just level one. How many, how many blocks was it between level one and level two? Well, I mean the, the gap, because I did, didn't do giant windows, I did two separate ones. <sighs> I'm just trying to think, guys. Um, I think it was four, because one was just an empty block, because we wanted to stretch it, didn't we? So it'd be two is an upside down stairs. Okay, we have two is an upside down stairs. And um, the third one here would be uh, the new glow stuff, uh, the, 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 the Watsy block. So that we glow. So I think it was four. Four? Oh, I've got this wrong. It just doesn't feel right. Hang on a sec. Got to double check. Hup. Down we go. All right, build this up. Gonna run out of these dark blocks soon. Okay, down we go. Ow! I broke a leg. No, I didn't. Yeah, so I can just double check. So not that block, but that block. All right, I could use chisels. It's fine. All right, that block there, and then it was that block there. Okay, wow. All right, so maybe it, it was that many blocks between. It didn't feel right, but then again, when I add the the two blocks in here, that does feel right. And then that, holy smokes, that one there. And then literally you go back into window mode, to the windows, um, which is um, here. I just got to remember, here. And there, I think, yeah, no, yes, that is, okay. All right, a bit confusing there, I know. Then go ahead and add in our chiseled, like that, and that. This is our last second window, guys. I'm just seeing how tall she's gonna be. She's gonna be a monster. Then add that in there, and oh, if I can reach it, bring up this bad boy to the top here. Okay, and then bring these up to the top. And that is how tall the second floor is going to be. Wow. Whew, this thing's going to be tall. We're turning, in, not from a, we're turning a mansion into a castle. That's what's going on here. Okay, so we need the extra, like the block run. So it's a tour up the top here. I know that for a fact because it's a, it's a smooth block. Stairs go in there. Okay. 
All right, so put that in there like that. Let's try aim for that. Ouch. Daddy, you gotta be careful now. You've got 400 plus levels. You don't wanna trip and fall down nothing, do you? That could be absolutely flaming terrible. All right, down we go. All right, how's she going? Wow. Much taller than I thought. Much taller, but that's fine. Okay, let's build up this middle bit and try shape it as well. So let's do that. Boom, 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 boom. All right, so let's go do some back and forwards here. Like build this up. This is all, we, I use smooth stone as a base. And then once I've done with the, like the base block, we cut out what we want. And then we start adding the bits of bobs and doors and um, hopefully some crying obsidian. Somebody said crying obsidian is in your face looking. So I've got to be careful how, like use it sparingly. Somebody actually said that, which, which I plan on doing. I like, our oh, crying obsidian looks awesome. And now that we can farm it, because we have a crying obsidian farm, um, well, we've got access to unlimited, if you know what I mean. We've got actually access to a lot of unlimited stuff. Just putting that out there, which is great. All right, so that's one side done. We're going to have to... Whoa, oh, try not to break our flaming legs. All right, build this up. Quickly finish this side. So again, it was that. How much do I have left of that? Ooh, I'm going to have to get down. I'm going to have to get down. No! All right, that, that doesn't matter. And it, let's just keep going. Um, and I think it was one more before the before the windows start. Uh, yeah, I'm out. It's all out. Okay, just leave that for now. All right, jump down. And the tower is, ouch, going to connect on the sides. Okay, it is coming along nicely. Oh, yeah. That's nice. So once we put the take that middle bit out there, remember that the glowy and the stairs got to go in there. It breaks up the blocks nicely. But to be honest with you, I'll probably go... Is this the center? If this is going to be the veranda, obviously we need a door to get in. Yep, just a good old door. And let's do some shaping. All right, so I reckon some really tall slices, maybe even a pattern up here. All right, let's do that. Let's start with the pattern first. Just remember it has to be one down. So that would be three, four, and then sort of bring it down, bring it down. Okay, just, just trying a couple things. Ooh, that might be too wide. I don't want to go something huge because I've got like the bottom level a bit more elegant when it comes to, I can't pick up any of my blocks. Hmm, all right, let's just keep shaping. So bring that in now and put one of those back if we can. Thank you. There we go. Almost a diamond shaped. Yeah. Let's go with a diamond shape for now. And we'll adjust that if we want to. There we go. And don't forget, I'll probably put crying up sitting behind the wall here. Um, just to give it that 3D depth feel. So don't stress too much. It's just as a, just trying to get a, a rough design, you know, going here for the, for the thing. So one, two, let's put some slices down here. It always looks cool. There we go. All right, come over here and do the same thing. Put another, oh, it was the second one in, wasn't it? Slice down here. There you go. And just leave it like that for now, maybe. Maybe, it might not be enough. We need, need something in the middle, but we'll have a look. All right, down we go. Suck them all up. There we go. All right, done. So head on out here. Oh yeah, we are onto some good stuff here. Now, remember the, the center here does not ha continue the glow. So the we don't have any on me, but the stairs have got to go along there. And we've got to put some uh, warped fences behind that. That's got to go on both sides. Let me try finish this off. All right. So what I'll do is get back down here. Oh, geez. Oh, this is coming along. I can't believe we're onto the second floor. Guys, that, uh, that asks the question, do we go even taller than this? Hang on. Holy smokes. Do we, do we go even taller than this? Do we add a third 
skinnier floor <laughs> to the top, like really going triple level evilness. But come on, you've got to admit that is shaping up really nice there. Like I, I, I like it. I like it a lot. You went to this lava and chains and and yeah, <laughs> that is just awesome. That is just amazing. Whew, coming along good. All right, guys, so what I'll do is I'll jump on a jump cut now, guys. I will finish off this section here, put the stairs in, and see if I can't hunt down some of the, the glowy and put those in as well. Then I just got to replicate all four of them on each side. But that is, I don't know, it's giving me goosebumps. That's got feels. It really does got feels, guys. Um, but let's let's go. Let's, let's, let's head back in there. But yeah, amazing cool i don't know this season might be better than last season i don't know <laughs> all right guys let me get on this jump cut let me hunt down some more of these blocks and i will be back all righty then guys i am back and as you can see we have almost finished off the second floor we've even got the thick ring around the top ready for more wood and I even started on the towers on the sides. As you can see, that's how tall the towers are going to get. They are literally a continuation of the bottom towers. They're going to continue straight up into the second floor here, which is great on both sides. Eventually, all four sides will be done. But this is looking really nice. Um, we will probably, when it comes to pattern, uh, the pattern here... We're probably going to replicate a pattern on both sides here, just due to the fact is you want to kind of keep it the same as it goes up. Um, so the patterns are not going to be different. So don't stress too much. It really that pattern was just a, it's a placeholder. Okay, that that pattern there is just a placeholder, and we will eventually change it out to the same thing. So don't stress too much don't stress too much but as you can see the castle mansion i don't even know what to call it now is coming along fantastically like this thing is going to be huge and there's a possibility we're going to be doing a third um on it, a third level on it it's going to be that crazy but you know it is going to be a very evil castle thing of doom that we we got going here I'm really, really happy with the direction. It's give it, It's got the feels. It's got that vibe. It's got that vibe going. All right. So let's jump into bed. I think we're going to go ahead and call it, guys. Thanks for watching episode 28 here of Minecraft Down Under. Don't forget, if you are enjoying the content, make sure you smash those buttons, guys. Smash those buttons. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I will catch you all later. Thank <laughs> you.